Lovely, lovely, lovely. I'm loving it. Seen a lot of places. I want to learn more. I want to see how our God created us and how men can be able to develop themselves, improve themselves. But destroy themselves also. And destroy themselves. That is the, the, the worstest one. Ignorantly. Yeah, yeah. So much. Hello. Kind of looking at me. <laughs> House of the Lord. I don't know. Let's see. What is in here? I'm curious. <laughs> House of the Lord. Look at the word is up there. On the wheels of uh, of women, I don't know what they stand for. Anyway, I ended here. So, in this video, I'm going to take you guys to walk around the city of Berno. I hope I said it well again. And we're going to chat randomly with the locals. At the same time, I'm going to share with you how the city really looks like. Here we go. So my second accommodation, it is right in the whole town. Okay, this is part of the whole town anyway. And we are in a very, wow, this is a very beautiful place here. I don't know, it is a church. Does it look like a church? This is a church. We can go inside. Let me zoom it so you can see it. Look at it. Trust it. This is the town hall square. Magistra Mesta Berna. That is what is written there. But my pronunciation, I don't know if it's right. Towards in the evening, there are a lot of people in this place. Yesterday, I passed through this place. There was a lot of people. Mommy. 
Hello, excuse me. Yes. Are you from this city? No. no. Where are you from? Slovakia. Oh, it's my next destination. I'm going to Slovakia tomorrow. Oh, okay. And yeah. where? I want to visit um, Bratislava. Uh -huh. I don't know. After I'm thinking to Ko Kos Kosice. Kosice, yes. <laughs> We're from Kosice. You're from there? Yeah. I'm thinking to go there. You are live direct in YouTube. What can you share with me about uh, uh, your time here in this city or in uh, Czech, Republic, uh, Czech Republic as a whole? Well, we just came here to do university exams. Okay. We're just coming from there. I don't really know what to tell you. But people here are really nice. Nightlife is great. Really? People have good style. Mm. And I like it. So. It's, it's more better than, yeah, it's better than yes. Slovakia? Slovakia? I think it's better, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. So, uh, a part of the, the ninth life. Okay, what uh, club or bar can you recommend for ninth life in for ninth life? in the city or maybe any other city in the country that you have been to? Well, <laughs> we've been to Barna Proci. Okay. And, um, also, my friend um, was in a Okay. Seven so, heavens <laughs> in English. In, so, yeah. in Sono are great big parties. I heard about it. Yes, too. Sono is a great club here. We've heard. Is it in the city center? Yes. Yeah. Yes. It's in a, um, near to Tabor. I don't know. Me. This is my second day here. Yeah. I'm new here. Our third. So. <laughs> ah, okay. Because I was in Prague. Then from Prague now I'm okay. here. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, what else? I don't really know much. So. Culture is nice too. Well, the buildings and the city. Yeah, yeah I was like, uh, you know, I was like a little bit um, skeptical or like my mind about Czech Republic is like only what I heard about them. Like beautiful women are here uh, for we the men. That is what I hear. And uh, good night life, maybe beer. Yeah. That's all. But no, it's more than that, man. When I came yeah. in, I was like kind of wow. Spielberg. Yeah. You've been to Spielberg? Where is it? It's um, very well, far. It, no, 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 it's, it's near really here. Uh, here in the center, but you uh -huh. have to look it up. So okay. Yeah. Can you? Nice there too. Let me walk around there also to shout some locals, meet some people there, and spontaneously uh, share their experience. Mm, you know the address. You know the address. Uh, just uh, type Spielberg. Okay, I'll touch it for you. Yeah. Oh, they are friendly. I hope I'll how I'm going to have a great time also creating content mm -hmm. right there in um, in uh, what I call it in in Slovakia as well. So yeah, spill back, spill back. No, Con contact uh, address. Okay, it is about uh, 1.3 kilometers from here. Yeah, it's not far. Okay. So, what last word can you share to my people? What do you recommend? Recommend for me to visit in Slovakia. In Slovakia? Mm. For sure. Mm. It's more beautiful than Bratislava. There's yeah, old city, it's nice. Yes, people are friendly. It's the nicest city in Slovakia. Yes. And mm. also the nightlife. We have many clubs in Slovakia. They are a bit smaller, but uh, there are the also yeah, is great. bars that are yeah. cheap alcohol, cheap drinks, spritz for two euros. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. It's really cheap. So yes. that means I'm going to take my train now direct to. Kosice. The name is difficult for me to say Bratislava. anyway. No, I'm going to Bratislava. your city, then ah, after okay. I come to Bratislava. Okay, yeah. Because yeah. from Bratislava, I want to go to Vienna. Oh, okay. Oh. So it's more closer. Yeah, yeah, yeah but so it's, it's closer to Vienna. It's like one hour from Bratislava, Vienna. So Vienna it's be. better I go to uh, your city first. before yes. I come to Vienna. Yeah. Those are the two places you asked me to visit in, in, in your country. Kosice and Bratislava. Something yes. else. Maybe Stropko, but it's a small city. Oh, where, where is it? Uh, it's near, near, north, near, near Poland. Near Poland. Okay. Yeah. Let me give you my YouTube channel so you can okay. see okay, your sure. videos. Is that it? Yeah. Yes, this is my... Okay. Every, let me show you something. Every country has its playlist. Oh! This is playlist. 
this no. good. Playlist, I don't know, this one, no, no. Okay. Uh, uh, this. this, this, yeah. Okay. Every wow. country has its playlist. Okay. Well, thank you. So thank share you. with your friends. Thank you. Thank you will you. see me when I will be in your country. Bye-bye. Yeah, so they are lovely, friendly. So I'm going to walk around and I'm going to end the vlog uh, in the castle where they suggested me to visit in this city. And uh, tonight I'm going to come out to walk around for night life to visit some of the place that uh, if you are coming around the city where you can be able to hang out in the night. If you want to meet the locals, meet some friends, this is the right place to be. So watch out for the ninth video of this city. I'm right in the main street of the city, so which is uh, Shishka. Shishka. It's called Shishka. <laughs> it's a lot of shops, and also it links you directly to the whole the old town square where I'm coming from. So this is how it's written: Shishka. It's Shishka Street. Mm -hmm. Uh, we were here yesterday with a young man, uh, Vincent, great guy of the city, who took me around and shared a lot with me. So I'm going to like just walk around and I'll take my time to shout out some locals. Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. Where are you from? What about you? Huh? What about you? I'm doing good. I, I like your energy. Thank you. Thank you. Where are you from? I'm from Ukraine. Ukraine? Oh, how long have you been here? Uh, a year and a half. A year and a half? Ah, oh, everything is good here? Yeah? No, none. You don't like it? I've uh, been here. Yeah, I, everything I is like good? Here. Yeah, okay. It's good. Oh, nice. So what do you do? Are you a student or what do you do? I'm traveling here and I uh, work sometimes. You travel and I work sometimes. Oh, okay. What can you tell me about uh, this city? Small but uh, nice city. Small and nice. Where are you from? Nigeria. A go mm -hmm. around the world. Thank you. So he's from Ukraine. What city in Ukraine are you from? Uh, I'm born in the uh, uh, city Alexandria. Alexandria, I don't know. I know uh, only but, Kiev. Uh, but I'm, I'm uh, study and uh, grow up in Kiev. Kiev? Oh, okay. You study in Kiev. Okay. Anyway, thank you. I run into a Ukrainian year. Quick. Have a good, good night. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank and you, you. too. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> So I think, let me just walk, walk down this place before I start going towards the castle I wanted to share with you guys.
And there is a park over there also where you can be able to go and hang out. And back of this place, there is another open space, a little bit like a small park, where you can also go and hang out. So it's nice, I think the people are protesting for the war of Ukraine. Yeah. So. So someone just told me the castle is over there. So it's like about 100 or 200 meters from here. So let's see how it looks like. Is this direction? Hello, excuse me, how are you? I'm, I'm looking for the Spielberg castle. It's right there, up there. This year, okay. Are you guys from the uh, Czech, Repu Czech Republic? No. Where are you from? Uh, Slovakia. Slovakia, oh, it's my next destination because I'm, I'm YouTube, I'm vlogging around the world. Uh, yeah. What can you share with me about Slovakia? <laughs> you are the second Slovakian people I met now. Yeah, a lot of Slovakia come in here. Yeah. Yeah. What city are you from? Uh, Lucianix. Uh, and uh, I, they are from Kosis uh, or some, something like that. Okay, thank you. Let me give you my YouTube channel. Maybe you like it. Okay. Spontaneously, I'm just like a little tired, but I'm just still doing my thing. This is it. Okay, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Subscribe and let me know what kind of content you want me to do in your country. <laughs> okay, bye bye. So the castle is over here. Yeah? Uh, let's see how it looks like. I hope to run into to some young people there so they can share with me more about the castle and about life here. But you know, places like this you normally see only 
tourists. I got a lot of Slovakian people visiting the city. Ooh. Nice. This is entrance or here, yeah, I don't know. Oh, it's from here. Yeah. Okay. Park Spielberg. Spielberg Park. Okay. It closes, open hours and close hours. Life of a traveler, explorer. Keep on exploring, man. This park is big. I think this park is quite big. I don't know which way to go. The park is big. You can, I don't even know which direction to go. Yeah, you can even for jogging, place for jogging. It's a young man there. Let me say hi. Hello. How are you? Good. Where are you from? From here. From here? Ah, nice. I'm looking for some guys too. To say hi to, I'm looking for some uh, some Czech Republic guys to share with me about their city, how it's life here. Yesterday I met one one of you guys, but I want to make more interview. So, who are you? What are you doing here? Uh, just chilling, you know. Yeah, enjoying. <laughs> Bad guy, He's just having his fun, uh, uh, calm, alone without any. <laughs> Can I sit down and chat hey, with you for hey, some minutes? Yeah, man. We are. Tell me more about. Where are we exactly? Uh, it's a castle complex named Spielberg. Spielberg. So it's a big castle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. from Whoa. like 18th century, 16th, like something. Like this. Whoa! Wow, wow, wow! And there is a, a like a big park around it. Also, like people yeah, can yeah, even yeah. make sports inside. I guess. Uh, like uh, inside the castle or yeah around uh, even yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, 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 sure. no yeah. I don't I don't know <laughs> me I I don't smoke I don't drink <laughs> ah, just, yeah. I'm luck I'm lucky it's not for me ah, mm. okay. yeah and just for who, for who is, is it it's for YouTube I'm a YouTuber how many subscribers do you have? let me give you a subscribe what's your name by the way uh, Philip Philip I'm, I'm Joel Joel nice. yeah Mm. Can, can I write? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. This one. Yes. Nice, yeah, 18,000. Yeah, I'm going around the world. Every country has its playlist. Go to the playlist, you see every country has its playlist. Yeah. Nice. Thank you, man. Nice. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> it's liking, <laughs> it's liking my channel. <laughs> I would like to travel this much. Oh, I don't know. I'm just addicted. I just like traveling. I just try. I don't know. I just want to learn, meet new people. Yeah, me too. Just know many people. I need uh, to finish school, so. Yeah. What are you studying? Uh, or how to school? Okay. So I will I can be waiter or I have I can have the hotel. Yes. So, oh, everything in the hotel. Okay, like a manager of hotel, yeah, yeah, all yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, good. That is good. 
You, when you finish, you can travel. When you finish, you have some job, you work some time, you can travel. Like yeah, the way yeah, I do. yeah, I can, but I have to finish it. It's, yes. It's hard, you know. Yeah, it's going to come. How long, how many years remain, remaining for you to finish? Uh, two months. Ah. Yeah, but I have to finish it. It's hard, like... The I, exam? Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah. I have three tries, so... I hope, I hope you get it in the first one. Me too. The first one, so that you, you're done with it. The first one is like uh, two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah. Oh, I wish you all the best. I wish you all the best. <laughs> Thank you. Don't be stressed. It's yeah. going to be fine. Yeah, 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 of course. It's going to be fine. Yeah. So, would you like to walk with me around and share with me a little bit about the castle, if you don't mind? We can. Okay. Well Here we go. Yeah, so I follow you. So okay. we have Philip here, yeah, local. And and your town and, and your city name is very difficult for me to pronounce. I don't know, but it's very simple like Berno or Borno. Berno. Berno. Mm -hmm. It's difficult for me to pronounce. <laughs> I have pronounced this this city's name for multiple times, I think more hundreds of times, still I couldn't get it right. But hey. He's here with us, so he's going to share with us more about his city, this yeah. castle, and everything you need to know as a student or a tourist, or even someone who wants to come to work here and live here. Share with us, Philip, what can you sh say? Mm. Your experience, life here, so like for, as a local. As a local, as a student, yeah. I can say Bruno is quite a good city for a student. Okay. So, not ex expensive. Okay. And the nightlife is, I think, very good. Okay. Yeah, tonight I, w I want to go out tonight uh, to make nightlife videos, to Whoa. share with the people the best place to hang out in the night. Uh, to find out, it's the best day is Friday, but... Yes. Yeah, it's weekend, so we can try it. Okay. The best day for nightlife in the city is Friday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Today is Sunday, I know. No much thing to do. Yesterday I came in yesterday, but I was like very tired. So I decided to have some rest after. Mm -hmm. So that is why I couldn't be able to come out for the nightlife videos. I was like too, totally exhausted. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. But like information about this castle, I can say much, you know. Okay. It's historical thing, you are not an historian. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a problem. Yeah. Likewise me, so that is why, you know, for you to share one thing about history, you have to study, you have to read about the place yeah. a lot of time and know a lot of things before you can be able to say. Uh, so you don't make I have one too much to mistake. About yeah. this castle, yeah. it was oh, the first and only castle that uh, stopped Swedish uh, invasion to Europe. Ooh! Mm -hmm. The first castle yeah, 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 yeah. that stopped the Swedish invasion to Europe. Yeah. Ooh! So, how did they do it? Do you have any little uh, idea? There is a legend where. A war legend? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, there's a legend where the defenders of this castle yeah uh, where in, uh, in the defense like for two months okay. and some of the defense men held in the Swedish uh, camp okay that in the uh, midnight they will stop fight so stop with attack okay so uh, the defense start to ring the bell like it's midnight yes but it, is, it isn't it, oh. it was not okay so they deceived the swedish troop yeah yeah yeah, yeah okay yeah. and they left oh okay no. oh it's not easy no 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 they're climbing some some hills and talk in english in that yeah it's not easy okay you are not using it often no, 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 no. He don't speak often English, so I can understand. He's trying. You need to have a lot of boss to do what he's doing. Respect, man. A lot of people can do it, even standing in front. Then number two, 
in front of the camera yes. and express yourself. It's a big thing, man. It's not for everyone. So respect. Thank you, thank you. Where yeah. are from? Nigeria. Yes. I'm a Nigerian. You know a little bit about Nigeria? Oh, like from all country no, but I know some people from, from Nigeria. Okay. But, but we are, I am from Izon, who I'm from the Delta State. The, the people who has most of the, uh, let me say, the resources in the country. The river people, we are creek people. Okay. We, our main occupation is fishing. Yeah. So I'm kind of sharing a little bit about me to, to my followers, my subscribers and viewers that don't know much about me. This guy is asking good question for me to be able to share more about me to you guys. Uh, one day uh, when I will be in Nigeria, I'm going to share with you concrete information about my life. It was a prison. That was a prison? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Over there. Before, wow. And back then, it is amazing how they can be able to build these kind of structures. And I have traveled around many, many countries. Some of them are back to 12th centuries, 13, 10, 9. I wonder how the hell they have everything it takes to build this. The mastermind, the architect, is from another world. I think they even build more better than, than we now. <laughs> the <laughs> architects of before. And in the Haitian times, it's even far better than us. <laughs> wow, because there, there were no much uh, resources, you know. There's no more many equipment. So it's like really hard. Wow. How long have you been here? This is my almost one week now in, oh. uh, let me say one week now in uh, in uh, Czech Republic. Just in Brno or? No, no, no. I just came to Brno yesterday. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I was in Prague mm -hmm. and now I'm here. Did you like Prague? Oh, good. I was like, that is what I said like a couple of minutes ago already in the video. Like what we know about Czech Republic, for me, what I knew was like good nightlife, parties, yeah. beautiful <laughs> girls. Yeah. That is only what they, they feed us. <laughs> what we, they, that is only what they feed us. So we know. But when I came in, no, it is far better than only beautiful girls and nightlife and party. Uh, great people in here, big, very beautiful country, clean, well organized, a lot of things, a lot of things. Though it's a small country, but it's, it's well organized. Mm, many Czechs say that Czech Republic is the best country, you know, to live, but I don't think that. But you know, that is life. You know, when you have something, you always think that outside, Elsewhere is more better than yours. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> this is every, everybody's problem. It's a sickness to almost all of us. But people need to enjoy what they have, you know? Yeah, you need to be content with what you have. That is why we have a lot of problems in the world, because many people are not content with what they have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sometimes yeah. sometime you even, like, I even have more than you, and I'm still jealous of you for nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. This is why there's too much problem in the wall. Oh, it's nice. The breeze is coming. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> ah, the breeze is just coming this way. I'm enjoying it. Ah. Yeah, okay, it's taking me down this way again. 
Wow. Would you have some questions you can ask? I yeah. Mind. This is a park over there. Oh. Man. So, how is the cost of living lifestyle in the city? For me, as a student, I think it's good, you know, I have, I need to pay the rent, I need to pay the fees, and I have much money to spend on my own life, so I okay. think it's quite good. Okay, how much for the house rent, the half uh, range? 10,000 check rounds. 10,000 check rounds, for student, huh? Yeah, 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 but I have to work, you know. Okay, St. Francis, the wild man. Oh? French concrete. Okay, so French concrete. So all these are, are great personalities of the past. And this is a woman. Uh, I can say I don't know him. Jan Hendrik. Jan Hendrik? Uh -huh. This is a man or a woman? Uh, like a woman? It's a man. It's a man, eh? Hendrik, yeah? It's the sculpture that did this, this sculptures. It's not uh, the famous man, it's just the modern architecture. So, for a student, the cost was like uh, 10k? Uh, just for rent, like, mm. for the whole month, mm. I can spend 5,000 crowns. For, okay, for uh, your... Uh, 15,000. 15,000, 15, 15, including yeah. your, your house rent? Yeah. yeah, yeah. All these charges yeah, and yeah, uh, food, yeah. uh, oh, that is what you mean? Yeah. Oh, okay. That is nice. I think for like uh, a normal person that is not a student, it can be like 20k. Oh, 20, 25, yeah. yeah, yeah. 20, 25, because I think yesterday I was with a friend. She's not a student anymore, she's working. And I think uh, she found an, uh, an apartment. We went to see an apartment. It was for 1,000, it, it was 15k. Ah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's a big, it's a big one, and, and it's nice. She's living with somebody or alone? Alone, alone. alone. So, with the uh, expensive and food stuff, I think maybe in the month, someone like she, maybe 20K or 25, 23, as you said. Yeah, I think that's uh, like average cost of living there yes. for a normal, normal person. Yeah. There is even bars, restaurants in the castle. Like most places, like most uh, castles I visit in Europe, they are like this. Inside, there are a lot of things to do, and there are restaurants. Sometimes there are even a uh, hotel inside also. Mm, Sometimes. But no, I think, yeah, there is hostel. Uh, there is an hotel inside. Uh, no, 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 but yeah. there is a museum, and there yeah. are every month new exhibition. Oh. So. Mm. Nice. Wow. So like dog? Yeah, yeah, yeah. but I don't <laughs> know what it, what it means. I don't know also. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot tell. You, you are the one that can even give me some good explanation, but if you don't know, then let's go. <laughs> and one thing I like about the cities, like they are quiet, not so uh, lousy, not so noisy. You think? Yeah, I think. You know, as I've traveled yeah, to can, a yeah, lot of places already, so I can feel like it's more calm, it's more chill in here. Yeah, like in the uh, Europe, this is a small city, yeah, you know? Yes. So, I understand that. Man. Lovely, lovely, lovely. I'm loving it. Seen a lot of places. I want to learn more. I want to see how our God created us and how men can be able to develop themselves, improve themselves. But destroy themselves also. And destroy themselves. That is the, the, the worstest one. Ignorantly. Yeah, yeah. 
so much self-destruction. This is a place for exhibition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like concert, little concert, like something like this. Last time I was there, there was like historic fight. Oh, okay. On the nights. Be careful. Yeah. What is that? Like a cage? A well? A well for water? Castle well, okay, it's a well. Medieval origin. The Spielberg well is one of the deepest in our country. The well is of medieval origin. In this year 1716 to 1717, the well was deepened from its origin, uh, from its original depth, 39 meters to nearly 112 meters. That is beneath the river Stravka in Old Berdno. Yeah, so it's a very historic place here. So I think this is all. From the castle, for now, yeah. yeah, yeah this yeah. is all, yeah. So guys, Philip deserves some like, give me thumbs up, give me thumbs up, and uh, subscribe if this is your first time here. And if you have been to this city, you have visited this castle, and the city as a whole, let me know where are your best places in the city, your favorite attraction in the city. And let us know, we might learn from you. And uh, upcoming travelers can also learn from your experience to yeah, yeah, be true. able to explore places that I haven't uh, or I couldn't be able to exploit to share with you so we can all learn from your experience as well. And I wanted to ask, like, did you like Czech food? I never tried, taste it. I, yeah, but I just eat some like fast food. I never really go to the restaurants. Oh, man. I have to. What, which one do you suggest for me? Uh, again, please. What chef uh, food do you want me to taste? Ooh, that smell. Like, did you hear about switch cola? No. Switch cola. Yeah, you should try switch cola. So it's taking me to another destination, another castle in the city. Yeah, it's called uh, Saint Paul and Peter Cathedral. Okay, St. Paul and Peter Cathedral, okay. Like a Spanish school or what? This is an uh, hotel. Huh? Five star hotel, Archelo. Uh, hotel? Yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah. okay. And this also, I think, is an hotel. This? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Exploring everywhere, man. Everywhere in the everywhere and everything possible that I can be able to share with you. Very beautiful hotel, yeah.
Seems like a five-star hotel also. Oh, this film, I think it's four-star. Four-star? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, this one is five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is this stand for? Um, I'm trying to remember now. Okay. You can see the whole of the city from here. It's not that so high, but you can still have a great view of the city. And this is the monument for the Soviet general that uh, free the city. Ah, okay. Oh, that's an input. So. It's an important monument. Yeah, 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 yeah. The guy who freed the city. This is the cathedral. There's a wall around it. Hello! It's <laughs> kind of looking. <laughs> so, who is this guy? <laughs> they couldn't believe it. <laughs> yeah, they sound like it. Okay. I think the second one that was built in the Brunel. Okay. So this is the cathedral of the city. Oh. There it in English. Mm -hmm. okay. The cathedral of St. Peter's and Paul is visible from afar and stand at a high elevation on the site of an original Romanesque, uh, Romanesque church. The early Gothic church of St. Peter was established at the beginning of the 13th century. Over the years, it was extended, rebuilt on several occasions and repaired, and St. Paul was added to its patronage. In 1777, the church became a cathedral on the order of the Bonner Bishop, Bishop, Bishopric at the end of the 19th century. Okay. So. And there is the legend from the war that they uh, okay. ring and at the 11 instead of 12 oh. because of the Swedish attackers. Okay, so. One of the particularities of Petrov is the midday peal of bell, which is rung from the cathedral every day at 11 o'clock. This commemorates the period of the 30 years war and the year 1645, when Bolno, <laughs> I said this, <laughs> it's difficult for me to say this, this name, as the only city in Mar uh, Morovia, 
to do so, defended itself successfully against the Swedish siege. According to the legend, after this, the siege had been ongoing for three and a half months, General Thor Titsson announced that he would be able to capture the city before the bell on Petro rang midday. The leader of the defending army, Louis uh, Radwit, the, the sources, was crafty and requested that the midday bell be rung one hour early and the Swedish army retreated without a shot. So this is a, it's a very interesting uh, history. Eh? It's part of the, the reason why the city wasn't uh, captured by the, the Swedish back in the days. Uh, the ancient times during their wars, so it plays a very a, a major role. So they they, they trick the Swedish armies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so it's another uh, interesting story to learn about this city. The city that freed himself without any fight. <laughs> he tricked tricked his opponent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you from Czech Republic? No. no. Where are you from? from Spain. Spain. Oh, hola, hola chicas. <laughs> Como estas? Muy bien. Muy bien. Uh, my Spanish end there. <laughs> anyway, I, I love to learn it. So what are you doing here, girls? Uh, we are studying er in Erasmus program. Erasmus? Yes. Madrid? No, no. from the north. Oh, what is Santander. it? Santander. San San Santander. OK. I will visit there sometime, no. because I've been to Madrid. Mm. Uh, but I've never been to the other side. They are asking me to visit Barcelona and this part of the, I don't know, um, Valencia, yes, these Valencia areas. Area. Yeah, it's good. So, how long have you been here now? Um, uh, until June. Until June? Yes. Oh, okay. Let me give my YouTube channel. Maybe you like it. Okay. Travel vlogs and sometimes some spontaneous interviews like ah. this. I quiero vernos. Yo también. Pero bueno, que ya lo subí. This one. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Good Subs luck with the subscribe. Channel. Thank you. <laughs> subscribe yes. and share with your friends. Okay. Bye bye. So spontaneously, sometime run into even Tories and also foreign students. So it is cool. It is cool. Like the way I always do my things spontaneously. I met a friend here. Philip is from this city, and one of the, the, the top guys here. So any girl here, if you're interested, don't worry. Yeah, Con dear me, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell them, tell them, tell them, tell them. <laughs> I was kind of pulling his leg and he said, okay, dear me, no problem. If any girl comment in the video that they want you, I will, I will, I will give them your, I will tell, okay, go to my Instagram or Facebook and write me there, I'll give you his contact. <laughs> He's a cool guy. He's a cool guy, by the way. Man, thank you. Thank you for taking me around. Thank you for taking me around. And if you like these videos, please... Give... Like and subscribe. Uh-huh. And turn on the notification button on. And uh, until then, see you on the next one. Ciao. I am Joel Tamara. If you like my videos, please hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification so you will get notified of my upcoming videos as i take you to every country on head until then have a wonderful and inspiring day bye bye